Guys, how are we doing? My name's James Borman. I'm an ex-Royal Marine physical trainer and sniper, and now specialise in getting the very best out of men. Behind me is a timeline that you may recognise. It is not your exact timeline, but it is, a, in principle, an idea of a timeline of a man. All right, so think about this. So let's get deep into this. Here we go. So, you at 20 are shagging, you're boozing, you're IB3, and you're magaloofing. You're living the dream. You are learning, you are growing up. As you slowly get to your 25s, it's all about the image. So we're down the gym, we're playing football, we're playing rugby, so we're building up, we're looking good. You're still shagging, you're still boozing. But as you approach 30, find the girl of your dreams and suddenly you calm down. You get married and suddenly the word responsibility enters your life. So you're not only providing for yourself, you're now living with a woman, okay, trying to pay for a mortgage and, and, and trying to keep a relationship going. All right, this is well and truly behind you. Now we have kids somewhere between 30 and 35. That responsibility suddenly goes up a level and suddenly you realize you hate your job and you are stuck in that job now because you have to pay for the mortgage, the bills, the holidays, looking after mum because she's looking after kids and then looking after the kids and then we probably have another kid and we've got two kids. Then you forget to use Durex and probably have a third kid and then you're completely fucked. So we're looking to 35 and then realizing you're overweight, you're looking down and there's a stomach there because your metabolism is not working as quickly as it used to when you were shagging, boozing and gymming. So you're fucked. Then we suddenly get to 35 in stress, a lack of direction, lack of purpose, lack of identity, you're lost. Simply between this point and this point you forgot who you were because of the responsibility of being married, having kids and paying bills. As we creep to 40, we suddenly start boozing to suddenly forget all of the frustration. Okay, we're not shagging, so, <laughs> so we're not even, so we're not happy because we're overweight, we're stressed, we're lack of direction, lack of purpose, we're lost. Responsibility is becoming overwhelming and welving. And what happens is because you are not the best version of yourself, Okay, you are not communicating with your partner, you are not the best version of yourself and suddenly you come into direct conflict with your wife and suddenly you end up looking at divorce, you're looking at being tired, you're looking at a lack of mobility, even putting more weight on because you're suffering with anxiety and depression. Now this is not your, your life in particular. At some point along this timeline, you have the ability to change. You are not 20 to 30 anymore. You're not shagging, you're not boozing, you're not down the gym, okay? You have the ability, okay, to be the best version of yourself somewhere along this line. But what is happening is that too many people are lazy, too many people are procrastinating, too many people are prioritizing other things other than concentrating on themselves and controlling, not coping, controlling with their lives, controlling the chaos, controlling the stress and being in charge of the decisions that they make. Just because you have kids and a family, you do not completely have to go off the wagon. You may be in a rut, you may have forgotten yourself, but you have an opportunity to do something about that. And the only person that can do that is you. Don't let this be your timeline. This is a worst case scenario. You end up getting to that 50 point, you're divorced, unhappy and overweight. You're gonna look back at life and wish you had made the right decision.